Hey guys, just thought I'd share my experience of seeing the SpaceX Falcon 9 rocket launch two nights ago. I didn't get a lot of footage besides some stuff I got and some footage my mom got, so just a heads up, you're probably gonna see some repeating clips. You came here, obviously, for the, the greatest channel on YouTube. Hello everybody. Rival Things in College here. I'm here at the second best place in the world to watch space launches. First being Kennedy Space Center, John F. Kennedy. Here at the Cape Canaveral Cars Launch site. Like, I don't know, it's, there's a bunch of boat docks and RVs here. We just, we like literally just got here. Elon Musk, shout out to Elon Musk. I know if you're watching Elon Musk, hello. Hello everybody, we just arrived here on the docks at, uh, where are we again? Cars, Cars. Cocoa Beach. Oh. T minus 23 minutes until the space launch. We're all really excited here. There's a lot of people here, tons of people here. I don't know why the majority of the people stayed on the shore, but me and my parents were on the pier, which was a great decision. It was a lot better. You know, you're 50 yards over on top of the water. You see the, the lights just across, you know. If this live footage goes viral and uh, gets sponsored, Elon Musk hit me up. I'm looking for a job actually right now for my summer. And we just like stood there on the pier, talking, taking pictures. Everybody was excited. And then the countdown happened and I was looking at my dad's phone and it had the exact count. And the second it hit zero, all of a sudden this, this ginormous flare, this, this mini sun just flew up from the water. Five, four, three, two. From a little bit away. And it was it was crazy. The ignition, the all the fire left a trail, you know, uh, the reflection on the water and it was glowing like straight towards me. It was so bright I could see into the future. I, I had 20-20 vision. You know, not only was the new year 2020, but I also had 2020 vision. The only thing that would have made it better was if I was listening to Justin Timberlake's 2020 experience, you know, that would have been the triple 2020, if you know what I mean. So it's up in the air, you know, it's flying super bright, everything, you can see everything clearly. And this woman, the Australian woman is like, oh, there's no, no fire in there, mate. She didn't say mate, and that was a bad Australian accent. But anyways, there was no sound or anything. So she said on the lines of, there's no sound, what the heck? And all of a sudden, the second she said that, boom! It was like that THX movie opening combined with like five lines and like an actual rocket launch just, just blew up in our ears. The <laughs> Good timing. And even the young Hispanic boy that was talking a lot, nothing annoying, but it was talking a lot, even he, was taken back. He was appalled by just how random this sound came. The, I guess the ignition, the sound of the rockets shooting off just bounced off the water and just hit us directly near us after 20 seconds. So all of a sudden everybody was just like distraught by just how loud it was. And it was only getting louder too as we saw this bright mini sun-like being fly up in the sky. And then after like a minute everybody started cheering and applauding and people started chanting. I threw in a couple USAs and Americas and the, I guess the crowd like that. But. America! It was an all in all great experience. If you ever are in the Cape Canaveral area, I highly recommend coming to watch a rocket launch. Peace.